Hi, and welcome to a very exciting episode of Our Road to Camelot. In this episode, we're going to get to the bottom of the toilet paper dilemma, and it'll be nothing but the poop and the whole poop right after this. Yeah, I heard that the uh, toilet at the police station got stolen, and unfortunately they had nothing to go on. <laughs> With that being said, we're going to talk about toilet paper in this episode. No, I'm not going to show you how to use it. Hopefully you're past that. I am going to show you what might be safe for your RV tank. So I have four different uh, things we're going to test today. We have um, actual RV marine toilet paper specifically designed for the RV, uh, it's been on the expensive side. We have septic safe Angel Soft. We have these flushable wipes that are getting very popular. And I wound up with the Mega Roll Ultra Strong Charmin. Now, what I discovered as we were going to the store that they don't make unseptic safe toilet paper anymore. But I have a funny feeling the smaller the writing for septic safe uh, the less septic safe it might be. So right on the Angel Soft package, it says right here, nice big letters, septic safe. On the Charmin, you got to look really, really hard down here in the really fine print somewhere. Uh, it, it says septic safe in the tiny print. And this one, boy, it is all over this package. So I'm thinking the bigger the writing, the more septic safe it is. But we're going to see, do you have to spend a lot of money on your toilet paper. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna form a little bit of an experiment. We, I have four of these little tubs. Uh, we're gonna fill them about three quarters of the way full of water. I'm gonna go ahead and put four uh, sheets of the toilet paper in each one. And then we're gonna just let it sit for five minutes, see what it looks like. We're gonna let it sit for another five minutes, see if it's dissolved anymore. And then finally, with a lid on it, we're gonna agitate a little bit, leave it for a few more minutes and see what happens then. So we'll take a look after each step to see if agitation helps or the length of time sitting in water helps. Either way, we're gonna basically get to the bottom of this dilemma. So here we go. So we're gonna start with the Camco. RV toilet paper. Let's count off four. One, two, three, four. So I don't run into any problems. I am not going to put it in the water until we put them all at the same time. Charm is coming apart easier. Three, four. Okay, here is the Charmin. Here go the Angel Soft. And finally, let's go to the flushable wipes. Now, flushable wipes, they're bigger by design, so we're just going to go with the one large um, sheet of that. If I unfolded it, it looks like it's pretty close to what those would be. Just going to put that there. All right, so here we go. There's the Charmin. Let's go ahead and get it all the way in wet. Can't go. Soft and flushable wipes. So, if you're, I'm not trying to do the shell game here. We've got Camco RV, Charmin, flushable wipes, Angel Soft. Siri set timer for five minutes.
set. Why is she busy? You on the okay. phone? Five minutes oh. and counting. Here we go. All right, so we'll be back in five minutes. We'll see where we're at. All right, so the first five minutes are up. Let's take a look at what we've got. Let's carefully take the lid off the Camco. So I'm looking down in there if I, it's still pretty solid. Oh, I try to pick it up with a spoon and it rips apart. So hopefully you saw that. Yeah, so that's actually starting to break down. That's the Camco. Let's take a look at the Charmin. Okay, so the Charmin, pick it up with a spoon. And it is holding pretty tough. Okay. So the Charmin is holding in there. It's the flushable wipes. It's holding on as well. Not much different on that one. Okay, let's go to the Angel Softs. Gonna pick it up. And yeah, it's holding in there too. Okay, well so far, five minutes in, it's looking like the Camco's in the lead. The other three haven't broken down yet. Let's go another five minutes and we'll do the agitation test. We are at the 10 minute mark. Let's see what we got. So the Camco, it is still kind of tearing as I lift it. The Charmin, see the Charmin is starting to tear a little bit, but it's still pretty solid. Look at the wipes, we got a problem. Mayday. Get some water back in there. I will dry that up in a minute. Flush the wipes. Still holding strong. Do it again. <laughs> It'll stop. It is, uh, might be tearing a little bit. Hard to tell. Well, let's go ahead and do five more minutes, but we'll do an agitation first. Okay. All right, we will time it for five more minutes. Continental flushable wipes. It says right in the package. Designed for toilets. Tested by plumbers. <laughs> you got the visual I'm getting on that one? Plumber tested. I don't know, do they have a particularly hearty diet that never mind. Okay, so let's take a look and see what we got. Camco. Wow. It is just soup. There is no solid in there whatsoever. So the RV toilet paper turns out to just be soup. Looks really good. Charmin. It is pretty thick. Look at that. It's still pretty thick. We got some big clumps in there. It broke down, but it's that compared to this. Yeah, that's pretty good. Okay, plumber tested, flushable wipes. Still one solid piece, no breakdown whatsoever. And Angel Soft, whoa, don't dump it. 
Angel Soft. Wow, that looks like it may be a good second. Let's see if we can put them in an order here. So if I was to put them in order, as we look through them, we have this one is very, very light, almost completely dissolved. The, uh, the Angel Soft is pretty much completely dissolved. A little bit thicker, but not by much. Charmin, large clumps. And the plumber's favorite, uh, still one big solid piece. So I think that pretty much gives us first and second place winners. And I don't care what plumbers say, you don't want to use that in an RV. It might be good for your home toilet, but don't use these in your RV. I would probably avoid the extra strength Charmin, uh, but Angel Soft actually might be a really good affordable option to the more expensive Canco RV toilet paper. We have been using Angel Soft ourselves because we I found that out from a reliable source. It's really good. I had not tested it until now. I was getting a little nervous there for a minute, but I'm actually quite happy that the Angel Soft came in a very close second to the Campco RV uh, toilet paper. And when you look at the difference in price between them, it's a hands down winner in my opinion. So Angel Soft definitely hands down, that's the one you want to use. All right, so I'm glad we got to the bottom of this issue. Uh, hopefully this helps you out. Remember that if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you really like it, hit that subscription button. In fact, you know what, just go ahead and hit that subscription button anyway. Uh, we need the subscribers, so go ahead and hit subscribe. Uh, you might have to go to YouTube to do that. And go ahead and hit that notification bell. We have new videos every Sunday at two o'clock. So uh, that's it for our science uh, experiment of the day. So that is the final for this episode. Uh, bringing you uh, better bathroom habits through science. Hope to see you on the road. Safe travels. Catch you in the next video.